Hi everybody, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel. This is part two of the reuse it shopping that I did today, this morning. I just shared all the woodblock stamps that I found and now I'm gonna share with you the trims that I found. Um, I did wanna say that you guys, whoever is um, also collecting and buying woodblock stamps, some, I heard someone say, I don't know if it was Felicia, um, someone said that they weren't getting a good impression and um, I have told this to many people before. If you have a woodblock stamp and you're not getting a good impression, grab a uh, mouse pad, something foamy like the mouse pad. You just set it down, put your paper on, ink your stamp and push down and just hold it for a few minutes. You could even just rub the top and then release. And because the spongy um, mouse pad is under it, you always, I mean, I always get a great impression um, with the mouse pad like that with the wood blocks, okay? So that's just a little hint that someone had told me and it works very well. And I wanted to share that with you guys just in case um, you don't buy wood stamps because of that reason. Um, you know, because you can't put them in the misty. But if you use a mouse mouse pad, you um, you will definitely get a great image. These are my grandkids. Um, this was 2010. My daughter had this made up with the grandkids on it. But um, so cute. So anyway, yeah, that was my little hint or, or little um, thing to, I wanted to tell you in the last video. And I didn't get to, I forgot to say it. So, all right, so I brought this up to her. Now, they're doing a different way on their lace. They used to sell them in little bags and used to put prices on how the, the lace. Um, now, they're doing it by um, ounce, so much an ounce. And you get so much more for a lower price. And so these were back there and I said to her, I said, can I, I said, could you tell me what it would cost to buy all of this. And she goes, I don't know. She says, let me go downstairs and talk to the head lady, that the lady that runs the place. And um, she came back up and she said, she told me to give it to you for the ounce price. I was like, no way. She said, yep. So I got both of these rolls for $7, you guys. Look at, there's like 30 yards on this one. I think that the thing said 30 yards up here. Um, but look at how pretty that is. And there's 30 yards of it. And I have uh, someone in mind um, may want some of that. Okay. And then this one, uh, again, this was part of the, the, both of them together, it cost me $7. Um, but look at this. Isn't that pretty? This one probably has, uh, I don't know, 20, 20, 25 um, yards maybe. I mean, there's a lot on there. And I love it because it's thin. It's so pretty. So I got those two. And then I got all of this. And this was all by the, you know, by the ounce. Um, I don't remember. She didn't give me a receipt. I don't know why she, because we got to talking. We were talking about the, the water and the floods and stuff and how bad it was. Um, just down the road from me. Um, they had some car dealerships uh, where they work on cars and all the cars are covered with water. Um, I was praying last night that God would watch down on us and, and please don't overflow my septic. And we got really, really lucky where I am right here. We did get a lot of rain and my septic did fill, but it didn't overflow, which was so good because the day before my husband said, I'm calling to get the, the tank emptied because we're getting flooding rains tomorrow so we had the tank emptied uh the day before so th i think that helped us a lot um but right now i checked it today and it is full but it will go down because we're not expecting any more rain for the rest of the week so hopefully that water will go down a little bit and we'll be okay um i have a uh, well in septic and i have um, a slow drain field the the house was built in the 70s and i think the drain field was the original drain field um, and they want 15,000 to replace it. So I can't, we're not, we don't have that kind of money right now. So um, we're just gonna keep baby in it. No wash, no long showers on the days where it's raining. Um, so, so far, knock on wood, we've been lucky. So, all right, enough of that, I'm sorry. I always go off subject, please forgive me. Um, but anyway, this is all the lace that I got and some of it may need to be ironed out, um, but this is this one here. Uh, 
I thought it was really nice, even though it's thick. It's a wider, a wider lace, but and I and all of this was in here. So, you know, when you get to the middle, you're probably gonna have to lay this out and iron it. I have no problem doing that. I have a little tiny desk iron, um, you know. So, my mouth is getting dry. I'm so sorry, you guys. Okay. Um, let's see. So we got this. Isn't that pretty? And this is a off-white cream color. And there was only a little piece, so we got that. I sat, again, I had to sit on the floor and I was digging through the thing. And if you see something that you like, you gotta keep pulling and see how much of it was in there. So um, I had stuff all over the place again. It's so much fun. I love going there and doing that. Um, so there's only a small piece of this, but it's very vintage. And this is like a coffee color cream, but there's only like that much, but it's okay. Um, I'll put that on some cards or something. And then I have this piece. And this was really pretty. And there's probably like some of this, you know, see what I mean? It's like curled, curled over, over. So I'll probably have to just take the iron to that. But there's probably a yard maybe of it. And then this was in the bag. Um, I'm going to take them out of the bags because I don't need the bags. Usually the bags are, you know, from sitting around the store. They get dusty and I don't, I don't save them. I put them in my own clean, clean stuff, you know. And this was pretty too. Look at that. Can you see it? It's gorgeous. And I got like this much of it. Okay, um, let's see, this one, and this one's vintage, vintage. it's uh, like an off cream color, it's not white, <coughs> and then we have this, which is definitely white, and this is what I had to do in the store, I just keep pulling to see how much is, um, how much is actually on, you know, now I got electricity, it won't come off my hand. Threads, different threads. Okay, uh, let's see, when it will, when will it stop? When will it stop? That's what I kept saying in the store. <laughs> um, okay, so we got this one. I think it goes this way. Very pretty and I got about, I don't know, maybe two yards there. Um, look at this, this is really thick. But I thought it was so pretty and I had to get it. Even though it is a wider lace, it's just gorgeous. And I was like, I have to buy that and I'll, I'll do something with it. But look at how pretty that is. It's very wide, but I just loved it. Oh my gosh, it's so darn pretty. And there's probably a little over a yard of it here okay um these little pieces i just grabbed them because um there's like three pieces here yeah there's like three pieces but um it's it's like a beige color it's vintage so i grabbed that there's a couple other ones of those in here somewhere um let's see keep pulling 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 all right and there's this one Yeah, and there's probably there's probably about two and a half yards of this okay I got this this is um this is more like not a lace this is a fabric I think um I think it's I think it's fabric um let's see because it's it's probably cotton I can feel it feels like cotton but it's really pretty on the end and I figure if I wanted to cut, I could cut some more of this off here and just use the bottom uh, on the card or something. Because um, it is pretty at the bottom. And that probably, there's probably about two yards of that in there. Okay. Um, then we got this one here. 
here's a piece of tape. Things just want to stick to my hand today. Okay, yeah, this is the one that was, it's tied up. Wait a minute. It was tied up with this black. That black is so pretty. I looked everywhere for more of that black, and I could not find it. I was disappointed. I really wanted more of that. Um, but this one, is it the same? No, I think this is, yeah, this is the same. <coughs> Sorry, you guys. See how pretty that one is? Okay. Um, and then... I got this one. And this looks vintage to me, too. I don't know if it goes that way or this way. It's really pretty. And this is um, uh, not white. It's a cream color. And they're probably, uh, I don't know, maybe two yards, maybe. So I got that. This is really pretty. Love that one. It's like a braided, uh, kind of like a braided crochet, maybe. I don't know. It's a little thick. And it's probably about a half a yard there. This was interesting. It was cute, so I got it. It's got little pom-poms on it. Look at this. And it has like uh, some sparkle in it. And the pom-poms, it's like cream color or coffee color. You see the sparkle in it? I thought that was different. There's not even a whole yard here, but I can use that. Um, let's see. Uh, this is mixed up with two different things here. Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting there. Hold on. Maybe it's not too different. I don't know. I think it is. But anyway, this, this here, there's probably maybe three maybe three yards of this maybe I like it because it's thin and this is great for cards with the thin stuff and it lays flat it's perfect for cards and I thought it was a really pretty edge on that um that edge is is really nice so I got that um this one here oh, this one's really pretty Again, it's really thin, and I like the thin stuff. And there's probably about a yard of that in there. Let me show you this black one. This black one's so pretty. Um, like I said, I wish I could have found some more of this. But they might have a roll somewhere, and I might end up finding it next time I go in. You never know. Everything changes all the time, and they always have different things. But I just really thought that this was beautiful, this, this black. I don't know, can you guys see that if I show it this way? Um, it's just really, really pretty. I'm not sure you can see it on my hand, but it's like real lacy. And there's probably maybe a little over a yard here. So I like that. I, I don't normally go for the darker colors, but um, sometimes you just have to. And then there's a piece of this. I usually go for the whites and the vintage stuff. I love that. And this looks like it was a collar um, on a dress or something. But you can cut that and use that. It's really pretty. But yeah, it's um, it's either a collar or like a waist of, you know, around a dress or something. Because there's actually two sections that are like a point. Like that so it might have been like around the waist maybe I don't know but in any case it's really pretty so I got that and let's see got this one again it's wide but this one has a little shimmer in the bottom I'm not sure the camera's picking it up but there's just a little bit of shimmer in there and I love the bottom it's so pretty got that um let's see okay 
Okay. All right, so we have this one here. I think it goes this way. Which is beautiful. And that one, there's gotta be at least two yards of that. There might even be three, cause it's still coming out. See how some of it's all curled up like that? But that's no problem. I'll just take that iron and I'll iron this out and it will be just fine. Yeah, there's more than two yards of this. There's got to be probably maybe four or five yards. I'm still pulling. Yeah, there's got to be at least five yards or more than that. Look how much I'm pulling here, you guys. That was the real long one. It, it, there it is, right there. And then I think this is another piece of the same thing. It is. There's another piece of it which is probably another two to three yards. All right, and let's see, we got this one here. And that's really pretty. Did I have one like that similar? I might've had one like that already too. Um, but you know what, you never can have enough, right? So if there's more, there's like another two, three yards of that, uh, there's plenty for me to share. All right, let's see. This one is gathered, and I don't usually go for the gathered ones, but it was pretty, and I thought it looked vintage, so I got it. Okay. And then I got this one. I'm trying to hurry, you guys. I don't want to make my video too, too long, but these are so pretty. I wanted you guys to see them. So we got that one. And this is a coffee color, cream color. Okay, there was some pe more of this. I found a couple more pieces of that. And then look at this I found. This is pretty. And this is definitely vintage and it's definitely coffee colored. It's like thick in the middle, it's like a collar. And then um, I don't know which side is what. This side maybe is the front. But it's so pretty in the middle. So we got that piece. I got this. There's a bunch of this. Again, real thin for cards. That's unique, it's different. Um, a small piece of this. And small piece like this. There is some of this here. I think it goes this way. This is cream colored as well. And this is a really thick piece. It must have just caught my eye because usually I don't buy the thick pieces, but yeah, this is pretty. And so I got a piece of that. Um, there's this one. There's this. This uh, is a big wad of it here, but let me see. This is uh, another thin one. Okay. Um, this one here is another balled up piece, but again, I could iron it. And it looks like this. And this one you could actually cut right down the middle and you could just use the thinner pieces on your card. They're like little flowers. So we got that. Here's some more pieces of that crocheted stuff. And I have this one that I picked up was real pretty. It says two yards. These were ones that were in the bag. So we have this one here. Um, it was still priced uh, by the ounce so I got this one and this has ribbon in the middle is it doubled oh it is doubled look at that so there's two layers and it has ribbon little uh, tan um, cream color ribbon going through it that's pretty I didn't realize that was double sometimes you can't really see them that great in the bags but um, 
Okay, so we've got this one. And there's probably a little less than a yard there. This is an eyelet, which I thought was pretty. Okay, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm going on 20 minutes. I'm so sorry. I hope you stick with me to the end. Um, but if you don't, I, I understand. Sometimes the videos go too long. But I wanted to show you guys this stuff. These lace, it's just so pretty. I got this one, and there's a whole bunch of that. I got this eyelet. See, you can't see them in the bags. That's why I was taking them out. Um, so there it is, the eyelet, and it's in cream color. And then we got this one. So there's that. got this one this one here and there's a bunch of that I'm almost finished you guys almost there's this one here and this is cream color there's a whole bunch of that too um, these were on these things already so they got they got this one and this one. And this is a cream uh, coffee color cream one. There's this thick one. This is a uh, elastic. But look at all that. Okay, we got this one. This is beautiful. Look how much of that. That's so pretty. But this real thin one. And there's, uh, that's a cream color. We got this thin one. I think that's almost, no, nope, that's different. This one, and that's cream color. And this one. This is more like a stiff, this is a stiff, uh, might have like starch or something. It's a different type of lace, but it's pretty, and it will like look nice on cards. And it won't matter. Look at the, there's butterflies in the middle of that. You see the butterflies? Like right there. It's really pretty. And it's cream color as well. A lots, of, lots of white, lots of cream colors. That's what I like. Okay, this one's, uh, I think this is elastic. Yeah, this is, feels like elastic too, and there's lots there. And this is the last one. Now, if you follow, if you watched my other video, you saw all the stamps I got, and then I got all this lace, and my total was $59. But um, I got so much, and it was so worth the $59. And I had fun uh, shopping, so there's the last one. So, yes, you guys, so happy with everything that I purchased. It was a good day at the reuse it shop. And now I'm going to roll all this up and put it on little uh, cardboard things. I bought this from Allie and I'm gonna cut some of these out. And this is like the big spool thing and, and you could wrap your lace around it. So I'm gonna be cutting those out and organizing all the lace and put them in my drawers nice and neat. And then I'll be making up a few little piles uh, for secret giveaways, okay? So if you're interested in, in lace, just keep watching and leaving comments. And um, sooner sooner than later, I'll be doing a couple uh, secret winners and you will win some lace. So thank you so much for watching and, and sorry it took me so long, but thank you for your patience and following through all the way to the end. I really appreciate it. And we will see you in the next video. Blessings, everybody. Bye.